about to get real. The realness. The, the, the realness. The, the, Rosenberg the on Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. We did do that one Epstein podcast um, with Kanye West yesterday, and we learned a lot about Kanye West. Dropped a few gems. So I'm going to let Kanye keep it real in the realness today. The first thing Kanye did when keeping it real was talking about the role he played when it comes to Nike and Jordan brands. Have you ever felt about a shoe since the Jordans, the way you felt about the Yeezys? The Yeezys is hip-hop. They gave us that feeling like we was back in fourth grade, like Jordan was winning again. But then Nike marginalized me. They only let me design two silhouettes. And Nike is like, no, we're not going to let it be a new brand Jordan. We already had that one baby. And we don't even like the fact that we have to compete with brand Jordan. Right, they share with them. And I'm going to tell you something. The only reason why brand Jordan is relevant is because of two people, me and Don C. Because Don C. used to order them vintage Jordans for me when I was the new up-and-coming style icon in hip-hop wearing Louis Vuitton backpack, a polo shirt, some paper denim jeans, and some Jordans where the soul was falling apart. Because they was the real retros before they made the toe too big on the new ones. <laughs> And he doesn't. He continued on. After that, we asked him about whether or not he'd ever spoke to Michael Jackson. And here's what he said. And at the end of the day, it comes down to classism nope. and racism. I told you it's 1,460 or 70 billion. I don't know who came up with a new tech idea yesterday. But 1,470 billionaires in the world. And it's only seven black billionaires of, of any African descent. We know one of them. You know what I'm saying? So that's like before Michael Jackson fought to get his videos on MTV, he was considered to be urban. And now he is Michael Jackson, the greatest musician of all time. That was his feelings on Michael Jackson and the role he played, but we also asked him about whether he'd ever met Michael Jackson, and Kanye West told us not only did he meet Michael Jackson, but Michael Jackson's praise for the song uh, Good Life is the reason Kanye West went on to make 808s and Heartbreak. So if you're ever mad about Kanye West's 808s and Heartbreak, you have one man to blame. <laughs> His Jack. name is Michael Jackson. Wake up, New York. Wake up, New York. The Hot 97 Morning Show.